Yesterday, uh, we had our college farewell uh, at Bitscoa and I went on the stage and I gave a speech which looked something like this. Very first day of Bits, um, day one, I think there was some lecture and uh, you know, all of us went there and the teacher asked us to introduce ourselves. Uh, so I just went on the stage and uh, introduced myself and I said, my hobby is to build companies, which was, everyone in the audience was like, what, like, who, who does this? This is, this is just, you know, no one says this. Uh, I said that, I came back, I sat, um, and then uh, a guy behind me just tapped my shoulder and he was like, uh, you know, even I'm into startups, I think we should build something together. Uh, a week later, um, you know, he was, in my, he was in the same hostel, so we started working together and uh, we were making like, I used to build websites, he used to write blog, and we were making like 1,000, 2,000 rupees. We thought we were Adani, uh, but uh, you know, that was, that was us. Uh, and four years, fast forward four years, uh, I think Shreyans is that person, he's my co-founder, and today we ran a $15 million company together, so that's how uh, it changed over the span. <laughs> Um, it was super interesting because over the period of COVID, I haven't been able to give public speeches. So for almost two years, I never gave a public speech. And it was great to be back on stage and just take that mic and speak. Uh, which made me think that I a video about public speaking. Uh, so I've given a TEDx talk. I have given probably more than 20, 30 public speeches over the last couple of years. And I am a shy, introverted kid but still I give public speeches. And though I'm not the best at it, over time I've seen that I've improved and become a better public speaker. Here are three things that I learned about how to become a better public speaker. So if you guys are trying to you know, give public speeches, maybe for your college farewell, or for your birthday, or for your college mein koi competition, ho hai, uh, these steps might really help you out. Here we go. Firstly, I think, you know, a lot of you guys should be motivated to give public speeches, right? Usually what happens is whenever you get an opportunity to speak in public, most people are like, oh, I'm, I'm not going to give a public speech, right? I'm just going to look at someone give a public speech. Uh, you know, even school, college, every time teacher or your professor asks someone to give a public speech, most people are like, no, I'm not going to do it. Um, and mostly it's because people are just shy or people are scared that other people might laugh at them or they're scared that they might say something wrong. There are a multitude of reasons. But I honestly think public speaking is like a great opportunity, especially for a person like me who's like shy, who doesn't speak much. Uh, when you're given a mic in your hand, like people listen to it. Sab log sunte hai tumhari. Right? So whatever you say, a lot of people will just listen to you. And I think that's the magical part of public speaking. It gives you access to a lot of opportunities. Right? If people pay attention to you. And that's great, right? Because everyone's eager to listen to your opinion. And I think that's the reason why I love giving public speeches. Because I can have people's attention and a lot of people will come to know about my ideas. So don't hesitate to give public speeches. Just go ahead. Next time you get an opportunity, just raise your hand. Uh, until 8th grade, I was really shy to give public speeches, but in ninth grade, uh, I just raised my hand, I was like, I'll go, I'll give the public speech. Um, the speech wasn't that great, but that gave me the confidence, it made me feel better, and ever since that time, I've never missed a chance to give a public speech. So, next time you get a chance, don't think too much. Bas, aat race karo, jao, say whatever comes to your mind, beech mein attack rahe ho, it's fine. You know, better luck next time. Just keep trying, and you'll get better at it. Another thing that really helps while giving public speeches is organizing your thoughts. Let me show you what I mean by that. Take a piece of paper like this, a short as a paper lelo, and uh, if I'm gonna give a farewell speech, then I'll write uh, the main keyword about just this keyword I'm about to talk So if I'm gonna start by telling a story about how I started a startup in college, I'll write first startup. Or if I want to talk about my professors, I'll write professors. If I want to thank my friends, I'll write thank you friends. If I want to say, um, you know, have a lovely evening, I'll say conclusion. So just writing the keywords over here helps you organize your thoughts. Or sometimes what happens you know, when you go on stage, you're scared you will forget the next point. This way you won't forget the next point. So it's fine if you just tear this page and take it with you in the stage uh, and read it's totally fine if you're scared to do it. Uh, if not, then just write your thoughts over here. Speech ke pehle bas, just go through it once 
and that will really help you you know mentally organize some everything and you won't get stuck in the middle um while giving the speech the third thing that really really helps is watching others speak watch tedx talks listen to good podcasts uh, i'll leave a i'll leave a couple of links in the description kuch acche podcasts hai which you can listen to one of my favorite podcasts is of it's called indian silicon valley podcast there's also a podcast called startup these two are like amazing podcasts i love the host uh, especially startups host is an amazing guy he speaks really well and i have huge respect for him and i admire to speak like him right so uh, when you listen to other good speakers speak you also get inspired to speak like them and that motivates you to speak better uh, usually you know for us as students we don't get exposure to good people hamare around log utna bhi acha speech nahi dete hain so listening to great people online can really help you improve the way you speak and the way you give public speeches um so do check it out uh, i'll leave them uh, down below and the cool part about that is ki tumhe tumhe jo bhi topic pasand hai uske bare mein you can listen podcasts right so if you're interested in finance you can listen to financial podcasts if you're interested in art or if you're interested in dance you can listen to dance podcasts so just pick your interest listen to those podcasts listen to those talks online and the more you listen the better you become as a speaker because you try you know uh, voice modulating and you try getting that vocabulary i hope these three tips helped you uh, i'll see if i can come up with more i'll make a couple of more videos if possible uh, but i really really hope that you guys become better public speakers and let's have a challenge uh, you guys can turn your camera on give a public speech uh maybe a speech about whatever topic you want to uh, say say it's an imaginary college farewell give a speech record a couple of seconds put it on instagram maybe tag me or maybe dm me dm that speech to me on instagram and i'll reply giving my feedback so this way you'll be able to put all of this into action and actually practice and learn and uh become a better public speaker if you are still here watching the video then thank you so much for watching the video you're one of my super audiences and i really really respect you guys uh thanks so much if you're still watching then go down and comment super s u p e r and i'll get to know that you're one of those super followers and thank you so much um it you know honestly giving a speech at bits has always been a dream and it was great to see it finally come into place so thanks and see you in the next one